Hello, everyone, and welcome to another edition of F Top State Final Table Highlights. I'm Ali Najad, and we're looking at event number 20 today, the Limit Hold'em Six Max event. A $200 buy-in attracted 915 players out to play. Prize pool was $200,000, and first place would be earning 41.7. Take a look at the chip counts as we go into our six max final table. Chosen Kid, over 729,000 in front of him. Poker Life, not far behind with over 700,000 himself. Win Humble and Vetiver were in the middle of the pack, while KD for You and Mischief of Magic were on the short stack. Kick off the action with the blinds at 7,515,000. Poker Life would pump it up. Mischief cold called on the button. Both blinds folded, and the flop was Deuce 8 Jack, all clubs. Poker Life bet out and was flat called. The turn paired the board with the eight of hearts. Poker Life checked over to Mischief, who bet 30,000. Life called, and the river was the king of hearts. He would check, and Mischief would bet out and get called, showing eight six of diamonds. He had made three eights, and that was good enough to take the pot. Line still at 7,515,000. Poker Life was undeterred as he popped it again. Mischief would three hit it this time instead of flat calling. Chosen Kid, Vetiver, and B for You all mucked it. Poker Life called and the flop was ace high with a couple of spades. Life would check call 15,000. Third spade on the turn in the form of a nine. Life checked again. Mischief fired another 30,000 and Life would make it 60. Mischief then put in number three, making it 90, and in came the fourth bet from Poker Life. Mischief called, River changed nothing. Poker Life bet out 30,000 and got called as he would show Jack 10 of spades for a Jack High flush and Mischief took a big hit to his stack while Poker Life got some cushion. Mischief of Magic was down to just 70,000 and change at this point and he would put in the raise to 40,000, essentially pot committing himself. Guess who, my Poker Life made the call and it was round three between these two. Flop was ace jack deuce all spades. Poker Life checked over to Mischief who bet out 20,000. Lines have gone up to 20 and 40. Poker Life put in the raise to 40,000. Mischief got it all in. Poker Life would show King Jack with the King of Spades and Middle Pair. Mischief had Middle Pair as well with the Ten of Spades. Both players made a flush on the end, but Mischief's was no good. And he was sent home in sixth place with $6,800. Down to five players with Vetiver on the button. Win Humble would lay down under the gun. Chosen Kid mucked as well. Vetiver would make it 40,000 to go. And in came the re-raise from short stack KB for you out of the small blind. Poker Life mucked and Vetiver called. Flop was 3-7 ace rainbow. KB let out for 20,000. He had just over 11,000 left in his stack. And Vetiver would get it all in there. Showing King Jack high up against Queen Jack high. Neither player would spike a pair and Vetiver would win the pot with King Jack High while KB for you would say goodbye, taking home $10,600 for a fifth place effort. Down to just four players with Win Humble on the button. Blinds have gone up to 12, 5, and 25,000. Poker Life laid it down. Win Humble laid down as well. Action was on Chosen Kid, who was down under 200,000 at this point. He would raise and get called. Flop was 5, deuce 8 with a couple of spades. Chosen fired the continuation bet and got raised by Vetiver. He made the call. Turn was the king of spades, completing a flush draw. Chosen would check. Vetiver fired. And Chosen would push it all in there, showing ace of spades with a six of clubs. He had the naked flush draw. It was no good, however, as Vetiver had spiked a nine on the end after being open-ended on the flop to make the straight. And Chosen Kid was sent home in fourth place with almost $15,000. Both My Poker Life and Win Humble were up to over a million in chips in a three-handed action. Lines were at 15 and 30,000. Life 2 bet it, Vetiver 3 hit it, and Life called. Flop was 6, 5, 10, Rainbow. Vetiver fired out and got called, and on the turn, he fired again and got popped by My Poker Life's pocket fours. Vetiver would show a 6 for a pair of sixes, which was good, until the river when the three hit, giving My Poker Life a six high straight and sending Vetiver home in third place with almost $20,000. So Poker Life had the chip lead in heads up play after dishing out that bad beat to Vetiver. When Humble limped in, Poker Life said run it and the flop was 6-9 king with a couple of hearts. Life let out and got called, eight of clubs hit the turn. Life would check and Humble would fire 60K out there. Life check raised to 120. 
Humble made the call, and the innocent looking for a diamonds hit the end as life let out. He was called, and an almost half a million pot was his after he rolled over the nine high straight. Poker Life was pumped up to almost 2.6 million now as Win Humble raised on the button and got three bet. He then shipped it all in with the Jack 4 off suit in bad shape up against A7 off. Flop was no help and neither was the turn. And the river brought kings and sixes to the board as Win Humble humbly finished in second place, leaving Poker Life as your champion. So Humble's second place effort brought him $27,800 while My Poker Life, your champion, took home 41700 We hope you've enjoyed all of our F-Tops 8 final table highlights. If you missed any of the action from this year, don't forget F-Tops 9 is right around the corner in a few short months. It's been my pleasure bringing you final table highlights this year. We hope you've enjoyed every minute of it, as I know I have. For Full Tilt Poker, this is Ali Najad saying so long.